Hello everybody, welcome to Project Beauty where we talk about project panning and everything beauty related. My name is Jen. Sorry about the remote in the background. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> How are you guys doing? I hope you're doing well. I wanted to update you guys on my pan that palette for I guess now February, end of February. This is insane. I cannot even believe that we're already two months into 2024. Um, it is going quickly to me anyway, I feel like. So what I wanted to show you guys is the progress that I have on my little palette. This is a Pantastic Ladies collab theme. And so it was called Fun Sized, which was created by Jackie Lutens. I hope I'm saying that correctly. And um, I would, wanted to use the, my, my fun size would be something super tiny like this. So small, fits in the palm of my hand. And it is the Pat McGrath Labs Mini Eyeshadow Palette in Midnight Voyage. And I love this palette so much. There's so much you can do with it, even though it's tiny. And I feel like the pigmentation is there. The longevity is there. The color is wonderful. Like the color story is beautiful. It has a mirror in it. It's like so cute. So cute. And I would definitely consider picking one up again down the road because I do like it so much. It's very good quality. I enjoy it a lot. Uh, I'm not wearing it today though. However, I do have my highlight is the highlight that's in here, which I'll show you in a second. But um, last month we had no pans and um, sort of like dips starting to form and everything. Um, I am definitely trying to go hard into these eyeshadows. I use my fingers to pat it. Um, I use really nice blending brushes to sort of get that smoky effect and I feel like the colors work well together. I can't really say enough good things about it. It's so good. It's so good. Um, that being said, it is going to take me a long time to get through the matte eyeshadows in this little palette, okay? So we're working with, um, so we started at 45.6 grams at the beginning of the year, brand new never like barely used um went to the end of january which was 45.24 grams and now at the end of february we're at 44.99 yay we made it under the, the 45 grams which is what i wanted um so let's go ahead and take a look at where we're at now so as you can see i have hip pan on one of the eyeshadows and it's already february i'm so excited so one pan now i can see how deep these are which they're actually considerably deep like you can see if i like barely tilt it like it it takes a bit to see the pan in there um uh definitely more than the like if you put the pad of your finger in there there's definitely still a lot of room before you would hit the bottom now you can see as well i'm using a lot of this one i'm starting to form a nice little dip there same thing with this one um I have a tiny, teeny, tiny dip going in that, but I use these two more often because I feel like I could, if I can tag team these on one look every single time, I could plow through two rather than just one eyeshadow. So I'm trying to plow through these two first. So I use all five of these eyeshadows in my look. This one, unfortunately, doesn't get used as often. But I will use these four in my look. But right now, I'm trying to get these five with the uses. I hope that makes sense. Um, so basically, what I do is I start with this in the center of my crease, just all over, not the center of my crease, but like on my crease. I blow it out, make it all like nice. And then I put this on my brow bone. And then I take a cream shade from another palette and I just buff that all in together because I have so much space between my crease and my brow and I have to I have to set that then I put this in the outer and I just blow it out and I'm seeing I have a little bit of darkness underneath my eyes here it's been a long day um, and then I put this in the inner corner on my lid and then I put this in the center and so I use all of those and I just love the way that the look is it's beautiful um, I have one more shade that I need to actually like push through so on occasion I'll change it up and I'll use this in a look instead of those two so I will definitely use that just less than using those two but you can see I have so much um so much progress already on this that it's just feeling so good I don't use a lot of eyeshadow in my looks so um 
that's why it doesn't look as used as it could but I try to use this the most out of anything. I even have a little kind of a tiny dip going in the mat, but the mats are going to take me a long time to get through. But just know that this is my primary thing that I'm using and my goal is to like, I would love to be able to hit pan in both of these by at least June for sure. Um, and I mean a good amount of pan, like, like even more substantial than this. I want good pan on those by June. So um, it's going to take a lot. <laughs> I'm trying so hard to get the uses on this because my goal is to use it as much as I can in the beginning of the year and then trail off and just kind of like, not trail off to like nothing, but trail off little bits until this is completely done. Just so I don't get super sick of it. But I love it so much. It's beautiful. I really enjoy using it. But that is my update. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Make sure you subscribe so that you can see my updates coming along because there will be so much progress coming up on this, at least for March. At least we'll get another extra couple days at the end of March. But until then, have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like the video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.